We're back after the break. Right now we have in red, Dwayne Hines, and in black, Michael Bullock. You can see that jiu-jitsu players aren't nearly as concerned defending a takedown where they'll actually concede uh, going to their back in order to, to get a better advantage uh, fighting for a submission. Michael uh, it, it really is in a bad position here. This is uh, called a north-south choke. Dwayne's got to sag his weight straight back. Uh, this is a carotid choke. So you can see he's, uh, he's in, keeping that shoulder blade off the mat is, uh, is an important part of defending this. It's actually one of the most fundamental similarities between jiu-jitsu and wrestling is the, uh, the idea of uh, keeping a strong position with your shoulder blades off, uh, off the mat. Nice escape, nice escape from Mike. When, uh, when uh, jiu-jitsu players go out of bounds, uh, they don't come back in a neutral position, they come back in the same position that they had established on their way out. So Michael playing a, an open guard here, um, looking for a, for a knee shield. Michael needs to create a little bit of uh, a little bit of space here if he's going to attack. Uh, Dwayne's doing a good job isolating the hip by lacing his arm through. There's leg leg lock opportunities here for uh, for Dwayne in the red. Uh, Michael should be looking to to control the outside wrist. There's a triangle in play. Dwayne Hines is a. Uh, a professional MMA fighter with a record of, of 10 and 1. Uh, phenomenal athlete, wrestled uh, NC2A in the, in the States and has subsequently transitioned to other, other combat sports. Again, coming back to the idea that putting your athlete on his shoulders is a, is a good solid position to attack from, you can see Dwayne looking to flatten Mike out and, and successfully pass his, uh, his guard. It's a very strong position for, uh, for, uh, for Dwayne Hines. Again, one of the one of the the crossover details between wrestling and jujitsu is how important head control can be for both athletes. If you control your opponent's head, you control the rest of their body as well. Uh, fundamental uh, idea in attacking wrestling and also in passing and, and controlling guard. I've seen these two uh, compete before. Dwayne's uh, he likes to play possum, uh, play slow, uh, and attack pretty intensely in the last. Uh, Last 30 to 60 seconds. So again, Dwayne playing, playing past uh, Michael Bullock's guard. Um, neither guy in a very strong position to, to submit. Um, Dwayne in a, in a stronger control position, uh, but we'll certainly need to, to, to advance to, to, to threaten any kind of submission. And in a, in a match with no points, the, uh, the positional game is only as, is only as important as the, the, the opportunities it provides in terms of finishing your opponent. You can see Dwayne coming back to this north-south position, uh, looking again for that, that modified guillotine choke. Um, Michael Bullock probably a little bit more aware of it this time, trying to control the hips. Um, if Dwayne doesn't close that space, he might deal with uh, Mike rolling up and, and trying to get those hooks in. It can be a sneaky back, uh, back take from this position. But Dwayne did a good job killing those, those hands off the hips. And there you go, Mike uh, oh, trying to use those long, gangly legs. Dwayne again trying to attack from, uh, from north-south. Uh, Michael looking a little bit more fatigued now, not doing quite as uh, aggressive a job getting off his hips. Uh, Dwayne paying some attention to that outside arm, looking to isolate potential Kumara there, feeding the arm through and transitioning to a nice arm bar. 
Uh, Michael's quite flexible through the elbow. You can see that uh, the not not tapping. Oh, there it is. Uh, Dwayne made a nice adjustment there. That's a Ronda Rousey style armbar dealing with extremely flexible women. She would often fold that elbow outside the uh, the hip um, against those resilient uh, athletes. Um, doesn't look like there's any damage to uh, to Michael's arm. He looks pretty happy. He's moving around. Um, doesn't seem to be touching it at all. Uh, Dwayne with a with a wonderful finish, wonderful per, uh, performance, uh, demonstrating uh, some outstanding jujitsu and wrestling for this uh, this wrestling crowd.